We begin with a story involving two members of our own 10 News family who were seriously hurt this morning. Marie Coronel, one of our reporters, and Mike Gold, a photographer, were hit by a falling tree. They were in a Mira Mesa neighborhood covering the storm early this morning. You want to bring in 10 News reporter Steve Friarena. Steve, can you tell us how they're doing in the hospital now? Uh, we've had some people out talking with them, checking with them. Both Mike and Marie are at Scripps La Jolla right now. Mike just went into surgery a little bit more than an hour ago. Uh, Marie is also scheduled to have surgery. We're going to show you the scene in Mira Mesa shortly after 4.30 as rescue crews cut away branches to free them and then rush them to the hospital. Mike was the one who called 911 after that tree fell. He suffered a compound fracture in his left leg and, as I said, wheeled into surgery about mid-morning. Marie had just finished a live shot for 10 News at 4.30 reporting on the damage inflicted by a huge tree falling onto some cars. Look how low it's gotten already, you know, with the truck, the level of that with the tires. And, you know, look, Virginia, since we've been out here, I haven't seen any... Just moments later, another tree crashed down, pinning our friends beneath it. Marie and Mike's families are at the medical center with them. I spoke with our news director, who, along with our station manager, have also visited the two. Marie's injuries, described as serious, also requiring surgery, we expect she and Mike will recover, but it's going to take some time before either can return to work. Now, they have one of the most difficult shifts at 10 News, heading out to scenes hours before dawn. Mike was out all day yesterday as well, covering various aspects of the El Nino storm. Then back here, along with Marie, shortly after 3 this morning, and they were off to Mira Mesa. There uh, have been many calls to 10 News asking about them. We also have... Uh, Comments coming in to the 10 News Facebook page, our viewers sending wishes for a quick recovery. Both are parents, both involved in our community. They will appreciate your prayers and kind words on Facebook. No yeah, doubt. That, that'll mean a lot to them. Uh, viewers have been so kind, and just to s let them know that you're thinking about them. Yeah, and we know Mike, he, we know Mike behind the scenes as a guy who is so happy go lucky, smiling a lot, and he's even smiling. We've heard a story here in, in the hospital saying that this broken leg, although it's bad, it's his Joe Theismann. Yeah. And that's how he has described it. Every morning he plays yeah. a 10 news tune, something to get us all going, something upbeat and lively. He is really uh, w one of the bright spots, yeah. you know, here in the newsroom. Hard so. charger, and I've done some uh, uh, events with Marie as well. She brings her kids out yes. and, and walks with the folks and, and interacts with them so well. Yeah. And Marie is a huge sports fan. She's from here. She is lovely and, and such a devoted mom. And we are just hoping and praying for speedy recoveries. Yeah. Uh, thanks, Steve. All right.